Hey everyone, welcome back. If you're new here, I'm Chloe. This is my last video in this apartment. It's so sad, I'm really not ready to leave it yet. So this is literally my last week in this apartment. Honestly, by the time this video is uploaded, I will already be out of it. So today I have my final beauty declutter. This is not makeup stuff. I did makeup in the last video, so you can go check that out if you want to. This is gonna be more hair and nail focused. I don't have nearly as much of that stuff, so it will be a little bit less to go through. I'm gonna try to be super cutthroat, like if I don't need it, if I don't use it that often, it's getting donated to somebody who would use it more. So let's just get started. Okay, here we are at the first drawer. Okay, well, this brush I'm keeping, it is my main brush. This brush I'm obviously getting rid of because I cracked the shit out of it, so I just need a new boar bristle brush. Most of my clips and combs in here I am gonna keep because I do use that stuff. Besides these, I kind of hate these. Honestly, I'm gonna get rid of this one even though it looks newer because it's rougher and too big, it's too bulky. My Denman I am keeping, of course, this is a quality brush. I am gonna keep my round brush because I use this all the time. I've had this flat iron for so long and I really don't wear my hair straight. I think it might be finally time to get rid of this guy. Okay, this is the one that I'm going to be keeping out of all of these because I like that it's a little bit smaller. Just kidding. I actually also have to keep this one because it's way too high quality to give away. Clips keep. I'm just going to throw this away. Keep. Throw away. This I'm keeping. It was gifted to me. It was my grandpa's mom's curling iron from like, I don't know, 1900 something. So I'm just gonna put this in a box for safekeeping. And the concentrator to my old blow dryer, I'm just gonna get rid of. Ew, this drawer is so dirty. Okay, next up is nails. I already did a video going over my lashes and everything. You can click up top if you wanna watch that. So I am just going to move these out of the way along with all my eyeliners. That's another video. Here I have to be super cutthroat. I don't have a very big nail polish case, so I have to get rid of a lot here. Start with the easy stuff. This I'm gonna get rid of. I've never even touched it. Okay, I actually don't know about these files because I feel like I never use them. They're too, like, they're too soft. Uh, this is old, I'm getting rid of it. I got a big pack here of these ones. I think I might try and take one of them. Oh, actually, I forgot I have these metal ones. Honestly, that would be so great. I should just take one of these. And I'm obviously taking one of these. I am still gonna hang on to all of these. I'm just gonna keep them as a backup when I come home. Oh my gosh, can't believe all of that powder. I am getting rid of these, never used. I will be keeping all the brushes and all my chromes. Here's the other one. Ooh, these are lipsticks. I'm keeping these, but I think I'm gonna get rid of these. I just don't, I just don't use them enough. Keeping, keeping, I am keeping my glue. This I can get rid of. I mean, I'm just never gonna need it again. These I'm just throwing away. Um, didn't really use them much. These I'm also getting rid of. I'm just gonna throw these away. Keeping, keeping, uh, keeping. Um, I should totally get rid of these. These are crappy, not even sharp. Shears, so. Ugh, I can't get rid of this. It's so cute. Getting rid of, getting rid of. Oh, keeping. I am just throwing all these little things away. How many, like how many of these can I have? I literally have three sizes, that's ridiculous. I'm gonna keep the smallest and the largest. This is an old tea bag that I cut up. You use it when you have a broken nail. So these I will keep. I'm gonna tuck them in my nail kit. This guy I need to keep because I, I need it to apply my gems, which actually I should get rid of one of these. I'm getting rid of this one because I only use the ones in here. 
And then this is a souvenir that I am absolutely keeping. Okay, that covers it. Okay, here's where I keep backups of all my products. Um, just ones that I haven't gotten through yet. Oh, this is completely full. I am gonna get rid of it though because I just like don't need it. Same with this. This is almost completely full. I just don't use hairspray, so donation. Ugh, I don't think I can get rid of this one. This is literally one of my favorite products. Might hang on to it forever. I just have an open one of those right now. Tea tree oil, gotta keep. I'm throwing this away. Wow, this is a sticky bottle of tea tree oil. Oh my goodness. Ugh, these two, I think I'm gonna give these two products away. As much as I want to use them, I, I just won't. Gross. Cute, I will keep that. My cute little headband. This is a nice container. All right, that's that drawer. This is my OG product drawer. This is the products that I usually use like daily and stuff. Um, these are my makeup remover cloths, so I will take these out of here. Okay, going through what we're keeping. Um, I never really use this, so I bought this for styes specifically, and I don't use it otherwise, so it's going away. Love this stuff, I'm keeping this. I love this stuff, this is one of my favorite products ever. Keeping, keeping, keeping. Keeping all the Paula's Choice products. Oh my goodness, I have an opened one of these. This is one of my favorite products of all time, keeping. Same with this one, if you can tell. This is such a good product, keeping. Same with this one. I love this product so much, but I'm almost out of it, so I am gonna use it up, and if I don't finish using it up, I'm gonna toss it. Okay, I actually do like this one. Like, I don't really want to get rid of this product, but I also just don't use it. This I'm keeping. This I'm gonna get rid of. And then keeping, 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 keeping. I'm keeping everything else. Okay. All right, here we are at nails. Okay, moving on to my nail polish collection. You can see every row on this rack except for the very top one. So once I clear out one of these rows, I'll pull those down. So they are in frame. So clearly I have a problem and the bottles on the bottom are back stock of my favorite products. Um, and I have a lot of freaking back stock of it. Uh, so all of that is staying and being kept, of course. This is part of a dip set. Um, I just don't think I'm gonna use this anymore. So I'm gonna get rid of this. I still have this one. So I'm just gonna keep this one. I will donate this one. Everything on this row I am gonna keep because it's the stuff I use regularly. Keep, keep, keep. Is this bubble bath? Keep. I'm gonna keep this one for now and keep. All right, see, here's the problem. Once you add all of these up, this is already 12 nail polishes, which is as many spaces as my nail polish carrier takes. Granted, I have two of those, so I guess 11. But still, I wanted a backup of at least one of these. All right, let's keep going. I feel like I need one yellow, so keep. Ugh, these oranges are so different, so I wanna keep both of them but I know I don't really have room to keep both of them. I am going to keep the SE one because it is smaller and it is just not as vibrant, so it'll go with a little bit more. I'm so sad to give this one away though. It's also like new. These two I need to keep. I know that they are such similar browns, but at the same time, they are so different and they're small bottles, so I'm just gonna keep both. These SE like quick dry ones are so expensive too, so like I just can't bear to give that away. Oh my gosh, this is so hard. Okay, see, and like here, like, I don't know. I don't know. I think I'm gonna allow myself to keep two out of the three. I do feel like it is so close to this one though. Like OPI is the brightest, so that's why I wanna keep this one. I'm gonna choose, I'm just not gonna choose right now. I'm definitely keeping both of these because I love both of these very much. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of this one. I'm gonna keep this one for now. I like it too much. These two are literally two of my most used and favorite blue shades I own, so I'm obviously keeping them. 
I'm only gonna keep this one. I love this shade. I've literally been using this shade since I was like 14 years old. I will never stop keeping, getting rid of garbage because they, like there's they're dead. Now for the shimmer shades and black and white. I actually probably need to get a new white and I know I need to get a new black. I'm gonna throw this black away, but I am gonna be replacing it. Um, and I am gonna be replacing my white because I didn't realize I used white so much, but I'm running low. Okay, this Insta Dry one I clearly don't use, so I'm gonna get rid of that one. This Essie one, I, I'm gonna keep. I think I'm just gonna throw this away because I'm sure it's like not even good anymore. Although this Smith & Cult one is a pink shimmer that I do like. I honestly think I'm gonna get rid of this cap because I hate these caps, they're pointless. Um, and it just fits so much better this way. But I am gonna keep this. All right, that is everything. And then I do have all those extras there at the bottom that I will be keeping and using up over time. Those are just literally what I use the most of. So I do go through them quite quickly. That's why I have so much back stock. Besides the fact that I went a little crazy last time at the nail store. Okay, let's count it out. 26. Okay, this is what I will be taking with me while I'm traveling. So ultimately me cutting down my nail polishes was for that. Okay, I feel so good about everything I've gotten rid of during this entire process, honestly. As I said, hair and nail stuff I don't have that much of anymore, so it was a little bit easier to get through, but there was still a good amount of stuff that I needed to get rid of. This was my final declutter, which means that all of my IKEA drawers are finally completely cleared out, which I am so happy about. So relieved. That part just feels so much better. That is gonna be all for this week's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe down below if you haven't already. And leave me a like because it really helps me out. I'll see you guys in the next one.